Hello students from today we are starting our chapter number 3 addition children i have red pens in my right hand and blue pens in my left hand how many pens i would have if i will put two colors pens together in a box so are you ready to tell what you said five yes five is the correct answer so children when we put things together it is called addition addition means we are getting more of something now listen the poem of parrots one little parrot singing i love you one more join in making them two two little parrots resting on a tree one more join in making them three three little parrots looking for more one more join in making them four four little parrots wanting to dive one more join in making them five in this poem you saw we are getting more and more parrots and when we count them together is called addition this is sign of an addition children when you will see the words like adding combining joining all together in any question that means you have to do addition i have four bangles now i am putting two more two more objects have been added count the objects now we have these four bangles we are adding two more so how many are total yes six bangles now i have some chocolates in right side and some are left side let's count them together 1 2 3 4 5 now let's count another side chocolates after 5 6 7 8 so total number of chocolates are 8 i have a dice let's roll it the number i have got is 6 let's roll one more time this time i have got 3 let's combine both these numbers 6 plus 3 equals to 9 let's learn how to add using our fingers because they are always with us and we can use them any time so according to the number we will raise our fingers so we have number 3 and 5 let's raise our fingers for 3 i am raising 3 fingers and for 5 i have raised 5 fingers so let's join them 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 so answer is 8 now we have to add 4 and 7 but this time we will not raise fingers for both the numbers we have to search for the smaller number so 4 or 7 which one is smaller yes 4 so we will raise only four fingers and after 7 we will start counting after 7 8 9 10 11 so answer will be 11 in this way you can do your additions fast in the next part you will see what happens when we add a number with zero some word problems and missing numbers now it's homework time question number 1 add these sets question number 2 add the numbers 